Welcome back guys and thank you for joining me in another episode here in our favorite factory game. This will be episode 5 of uh, Satisfactory. This is my last playthrough in this game, my final factory. So I'm not gonna start another one. Um, a lot of things have changed. Now we have colors. I was able to do that. Let's start from this side. The copper is the same as it was, no modification whatsoever. I've unlocked the blueprint mark one designer. Now I have some good news. I was able to recover my blueprints. So even though I redid all this, even though we are mark one, I'm still able to put whatever I did in mark two, mark three. So that's just amazing. If you look at this. Of course, I don't have the materials. I mean, I have some because I've been running around the map, but I didn't unlock refineries yet. <laughs> I can put them down, which is not normal, by the way. I think Coffee Stain should modify that. I mean, it should only let you build the stuff that you unlocked. We didn't unlock the manufacturers yet. Yet, look at this. I can put them down, okay? Because I found the plastic, I found the steel, I found aluminum outclad sheets, whatever, in the world. Well, I was roaming around looking for a bunch of Mercer spheres because now we got the dimensional people unlocked, which is just outstanding. If you look at this, look at it. Uh, it's just amazing. Okay, good, good, good. Let's focus a little bit, I I took those two um, impure, I think they are, in their quartz nodes. Quartz is coming that way. Um, half of them is doing uh, silica, half of them is doing crystals. Those boxes are filled up, the dimensional depot as well. The excess is going into the middle and then it's getting synced because now we have the Watson sap. Okay? The other guy in there, if you look, there is a belt going up to there in there because that one was a normal or pure, I don't remember. I think it's a pure Sam node. Or so I took that, brought it in here, all of it. Two of those guys, I think they have summer slips on them. I don't want to get down yet. I think they have summer slips on them, so we double in the production. That one that you see in there on that line and in there in that box in, in there, it's a reanimated Sam. Oh, I think so because it's been something like a week. Yeah, reanimated Sam. We also made it happen, a few of those, in a crafting bench with pipes and steel wire. Uh, wire, not steel. I don't know why I say steel. I say steel because I wanted to get in here. Kind of modify the colors a little in here. Finally, I realized that that one needed another assembler in there, so I put another assembler in there. Now we're making as we should the smart rating. We got a bunch in there, 1,800 almost. Oh, so we can already put a 1,000 in this way. Which now has uh, beautiful colors, guess what? We got in there. Let me put it in for the more. Something tasty wasting for us. Waiting, 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 waiting. So, those are the slugs that I collected in the wall. A bunch of them. Put them in boxes, put in constructors. Each one of those constructors has a summer slope inside of them. So, when they will make the power shots, we will have double shot production. All that I need to do in order to start that build, that way, is connected to the power. So one of those two poles huh, in the front will be connected to the power and we're gonna have double shots. Didn't start it because I wanted to show you that. That one is the same, those are kind of the same. Of course, I modify all those builds, they are mark free. Right now everything is moving and grooving like it should. Those will go away. We have a bunch more boxes, almost. Each and every single one of them has a dimensional depot up top. I run around the map a lot. Okay, a lot. I unlocked the blades. It was a lot easier, but still, it was so difficult. It took a few like six hours, I want to say. Going foundations and stuff, majigis everywhere. It was a chore. I need that. I need that jetpack in my life, but it is what it is. Anywho. Here we are. Um, hmm. Got a bunch of summer sloops and stuff. As you can see in my hand, we have explosives because that material node in there 
was blocked by a boulder. Well, apparently still blocked by a boulder. I don't know how because that one blew up, mister. I blew it up. So there is a down there somewhere. An impure sulfur node. I took that one as well. Put a miner on it. Grabbed the sulfur. Start scanning it. Man, a bunch of stuff. Grab some coal out of there. Made it happen with the gunpowder. Then made nobelisks. Blow that thing up. We get a bunch of quick wire in there, it's being stored, didn't have breath it in here. I mean I brought like two loads, my inventory, put them in a box in here, but that's it. It's getting stored in there, we have a dimensional leap on, on top of it. The excess is getting sent. That one I think, it's a normal node, I think. I've upgraded it, it's pushing up 120 right now. So we're making a bunch of quick wire in there. And we get the number disks as well. What else have I done here? Uh, modified that belt with the screws. We had two in there, uh, Mark II going into that assembler. Now that way it's a Mark III. Everything is moving and grooving like it should. The fitting lines in there for the iron, that guy and the guy in there became Mark III. Got rid of the belt up top, as I told you I will. Those uh, lifts for that assembler. They became mark free just like the belt in the back with the screws everything is working as intended believe it or not we don't have any fluctuations that's my entrance in there put some funky funky roofs on it I unlock the roofs and i stuck inside there somehow i was able two lights it's looking just amazing okay i love it don't say anything bad about it because we're gonna have issues in here Sink, sinking all the excess from those beams and pipes that we're making in there. That's the same production line what we did in the last episode. Of course, all that belt and those lifts are marked free now. It didn't work because those lifts were marked one. That's why we're not transporting 120. Initially made them mark two. Uh, now they became mark free because we have the mark free belts. What else? I put that assembler down. It's taking 2.5 modular frames from there and it's taking 30 steel beams. So all our production of beams is going to that assembler and we're making the versatile framework. You can see it running in there. I don't know how many we have. Okay, I have no idea. But we're gonna check it out. I already started putting there a bridge, let's call it. That's gonna be our highway to the coal cold but it's on the other side we have two normal nodes and two impure nodes i believe we're gonna need a bunch more power because that's the way it's gonna have to be oh man i gotta love this i have the blades we have in there eight coal generators right now the steel factory is the same those became upgraded with shards that is what it is i needed the power here no other choice let's see we have 350 versatile framework good stuff uh let's take care of those slugs first shall we well let me show you the power you see this train line in here it means there are no variation the machinery is not stopping and the ring is stopping because it put these things everywhere everywhere the excess of ingots that it may happen to have as you can see getting sick coming from there that one it indicates but in here this two in here uh they had issues okay so those smelters were getting filled up so i put in here a smart splitter because quick wire i like that one as well and now we're sinking the excess of units also all this production that we had in here this one i mean i don't know why i have those on yellow in there but all of the all of this is getting synced you see that one is going into a sink, that one is going to a sink, that one is going inside there, that's how I bring them in, and it's going into the sink. Everything, except the screws, maybe even the screws, yeah, even the screws are going into a sink down below, everything. So the, the, this production, uh, apparently I didn't do it for the plates. Yeah, I forgot to do it for the plates. So I put in here the smart splitter 
overflow to the left, but I did not put the lift. That's why those two guys are in yellow. Well, let's take care of that one right now before taking care of those logs. With this occasion, you will see what's underneath as well. Oh man, gotta love the blades. Gotta love the blades. So in here we get a little light. This is how I did those. It's one panel and another panel. I moved them with H and put them inside there. Looking good, looking good. Uh, not a bunch of light in here, as you can see. This I modified it. it used to come here and unlock those poles that you can put on the ceiling. Spend a few good points in the sink. Grab some customization as well. This is everything that is getting synced in there. That's my lift. For... <laughs> Stay up here. Uh, the excess plates, basically, that we're gonna have to address. Let's just invent another merger in there somewhere. If I can't, is uh, straight? Yeah, default. Okay, we're gonna sync those as well. Because that one I'm marked free. It is. All the way, all the way. I put the copper paint on that and on our hub because I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Still a bunch of stuff to unlock in the mem and in the customization, but it wasn't so. It is what it is. Let's take care of the slugs now, and then I'm gonna show you the crates in here. So, in here, we got these guys. We have a few 25 and another 9. The yellow ones, we have 29 and another 8. These guys, 9 and another 9. This guy's saying. Each and every single one has a summer slot in here. So the output is going to be double for all of them. And now all that we need to do, everything is rigged up. Let's connect this on the bar. And each and every single one of them should start working. This said, uh, we should have the bar shards soon enough. Here we are, looking just amazing. They're going to be deposited in the box. And then I'm going to delete all this mess in here. Oh, those are empty already? Okay, well, we can clean it up in that case. They didn't have that many. Good stuff is gonna take a minute. Let me show you the boxes. The hub became with that color because, as I told you, love it. So, dimensional depot on top of each and every single one is the same story as it was before. So it's plates, rods, screws, in here reinforced rotors, in here motors, but we're not producing any, it's only what I found into the wall. They've been put in the dimensional depot. Uh, these guys, we're producing them, it's good. The dimensional depot is filled up, of course. Stators, we're not producing them, only what I found into the wall. These guys, we are producing them, but I didn't connect the production to these boxes because I'm not sure how to do it. These guys, the in case beams, they didn't even wanna unlock them, it's only what I found it well. We'll see how that one is gonna go. Initially these lights were just outstanding. I had a bunch of light in here, but now that I put this lift in the dimensional depot, I don't have as much light as I would like. Anywho, we found some of these guys in here. We're gonna have to build them now that we have the quartz in there. Is gonna be accessible for us. A limiters, unlock them in the MAM. Uh, just built a few in the crafting bench. We have to build them. Computers, we didn't unlock them yet. Those come from a manufacturer. Only what I found into the world. Same stuff for these guys. The secret bits. Uh, already showed you the quick wire. This guy used to be filled up. The other one in the back, I'm pretty sure it's filled up with sinking a bunch of stuff. Copper sheets cables these guys are the old guys let's get in here so nothing new here in here i went all the way under here i stopped because i didn't have enough of those spheres but i used a bunch so if you look at it three another seven another 13 three another seven another 13 and another 23 so this give me gives me gives us the best upload speed possible 240 per minute the upload this one will extend 
the stacks okay but i don't have those 23 summers i mean if i would destroy all of these guys i will have them but i don't want to destroy them because i need them in my life we still have 10 summer uh, mercy spheres so it's kind of fine we will do that at some point i will make another run around the map but i want to have my jetpack to do that because it's been pretty tedious and i didn't love it we get the production amplifier this one we don't have it yet of course no computer i mean i could do it i don't know if i have 50 computers or not but yeah i got them but i don't want to do it yet okay it's not it's not a good moment out of the colors. Uh, already put in here the advanced hill production milestone. So let's just send this one up because I want those wires, automatic milestone wires. Milestone reached. The miner Mark II allows extraction of resources from nature to fix it at twice the speed of the Mark I model. Miners can be directly upgraded to Mark II without removing the Mark I model, just like conveyor belts and other upgradable infrastructure. Unfortunately, setting up the production of advanced steel parts and project part number three, automated wiring, will not be as easy. Every moment you delay reduces the chances of saving humanity. I will not show you the predictions, it would only demotivate you. You heard the lady, right? So I sharded all of these guys. Give them the dragon breath in there. Just to make it uh, work faster. Hey, 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 easy, bud. Is 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 because I want to delete them from here. Not long to go, you know. They're pooping up shards really fast, but still a ways to go. Okay, good stuff. So we unlock that advanced steel production. That means we will be able to make our auto magic wires. Okay, let's see here. Uh, parts. What we're not building? It's a bunch that we're not building. Okay. It's a bunch. We're not building the stages. We just unlock them. Okay, chill. The motors. We know already how we're gonna build them. We get the assemblers, those that are making 10 and 10, 5 and 5 are going into another assembler, and we're gonna have 2.5 per minute. It's gonna be just fine. Automated wiring. This is what we're interested in. So, apparently, we're gonna need to build some stators for it. So, it's gonna take Steel and wire or stealing quick wire. Well, wow, this is pretty interesting because we are building a bunch of quick wire that we're not using it anything. I think we're gonna go with that. And uh, I think we're gonna go with that because it's a better recipe, we thinks, for our pipes, which we're not making that many between you and I. So that one, it's unlocked. Is producing a manufacturer, but since we didn't unlock the manufacturer, it doesn't say it. Okay. Even though we don't have the connectors, so <clears throat> um, cables. We got the cables in here, but we don't have enough. I mean, we have enough for our own needs in here. Making something like thirty, there is no point in taking this. By the way, all of these guys are connected to the sink. Oh, it's working. The excess is getting sick. Okay, because that's the way to do it. Just like those wires, just like the copy sheets, everything. So, we're gonna need more of these guys. Lucky for us, we unlocked the mark to Can I build for it? Yeah. We don't have technique started building the keys. But since I found a bunch in the wall, it's gonna be fine. So this is gonna be really easy, let's call it. Uh, because this boy is making 120. That boy is making 120 or less than 120, I don't remember. Let's go and check it out. We can merge those productions onto one single miner. And uh, it's gonna be just fine. 104 so it's gonna be 204 but 224 I said so we can merge them and we just liberate one of those that means we have 240 production um how do I wanna do this so 
it's gonna be easy you know just take that break it put it put a split in there one goes in there one goes in here life is beautiful or from here and we just deliberate it this way i think this is the one that i want to free i will put it in that way and we start building the wires in there that one will go away from there we can put in there our smelters which is what it's just like this you know i mean easy easy they must be easy um we're gonna have our ingots we can make a bunch of wire that is gonna be used for those taters only as much as we need no more not more than that i think i should have had a sink in here or at least on those lines because i see that those guys are gonna fill up there should have had an excess sink an overflow sink on those two lines yes this one is saying for example you put it 120 the thing that is doing 120 is not true it's doing a little more that's why those machines is getting filled up or he's getting filled up with wire. I don't like seeing that. In theory, it will never stop, but in reality, it does. Um, what else? So, we're gonna need to build the staters just to make those automatic wires. Okay, so we can grab some of those pipes from there, but there is a little cavity those pipes were meant only to be for my personal needs nevertheless that one doesn't apply because guess what we have oh my god so many shirts uh we've got all the beams being eaten one two three four perfect by um, the first attack actually so the first things that will need to be done in here is take care of this steel production because it's not enough we we're not making enough this serious part i would like this boy that is making the versatile to be moved next to those boys which are making the smart plating so get rid of him out of here redirect that belt with the modular frames i don't know where and grab this one but in here we're gonna need a little more place. This one must go away. So I think we're gonna delete kind of everything because I wanna produce more. More, more, more ingots for BIG, more still ingots. Uh, so the other good recipe, I think it was made, let's see, um, still ingots. It was one more limestone. Ah, oh, I think it was made in a manufacturer, mister. Oh no, it's done in a foundry, right in here. So we could do it in the foundry, amazing. Because if you insert concrete in here, it's gonna like double, triple your production. It's called molded beam and molded pipe. Molded steel pipe, here we go. Here we go. So we have a hundred and something ingots. Instead of using constructors, we're gonna have to use Foundries, okay. I don't have the concrete on me, but it's on in the dimensional depot. Guess what? We're doing really good. So we will need these guys, and we will need these guys. So these are the beams. This the, these are the, the pipes. Okay. This one it's 50 stealing guts. This one it's 120. Our production at this point it's. 180, I believe. Me thinks. Uh, should we go all out on it? I mean, I think. Because if I make those two miners on the coal mark too, and that miner on the iron mark too, I can put another four smelters and double all that production in there. So instead of having uh, 180, we're gonna have 360. We are limited about. 70 with the bells? Yeah, we don't have mark for it. Uh, uh, let's see if we can get mark for it, like really soon. Because that one will uh, alleviate a lot of problems in here. Man, I want the jetpack. I want the jetpack. Let's look after the. Oh, 
I think the jetpack comes with the oil production nevertheless. So don't care about those. Don't care about those. Jump pads. We're gonna need the tractors, that's for sure. Uh I would like to have those hybrid tubes. Yeah, well. I'm afraid Mark IV comes after sending up this phase, so it ain't gonna be available for us. Nevertheless, we could still make it work. We could still make it work, you know how? Uh, double the, blade, the belts. So we're gonna keep this belt, for example, with 270. We're making 180. We're gonna keep it with 180 and gonna bring another belt with another two lifts and another belt with another 180. And we kinda set in there. Okay, so let's say we have 360 still in it. Let's, let's just assume. Okay. 45 so 90 beams because 240 okay that leaves me with 120 ingots 120 ingots means twice in the half let's say so 120 pipes and 90 beams i think that's a good number wouldn't you beginning of the game like right now we need more beams after that we need more pipes so i think i think i'm not sure I think that the best scenario is to have in here only one of these making 45 beams, but 30 are being eaten by this. Well, we can put a summer slip in it, but two, I'm gonna have 90. That will leave me a 60, which is just outstanding. Of course, power is gonna be an issue, um, but power we're gonna take care of it. Like right now, 120. That leaves me 240. 240 means uh, what? For five times almost this. That's 250 steel pipes. I think that's a good number. I think that's a good number. Okay. Uh, let's delete this. Delete this. Uh, I made everything happen. Well, actually, we can keep those. Let's see. The blueprints are done. Sand node is done for now. Let's call it done. It ain't exactly done, but it's done. We need more power, that's for sure. The steel is gonna have to be upgraded. So, upgrade the steel. Oops! <laughs> caps! Yeah, caps. Okay, upgrade the steel. Perfect. I gotta close it for here. from here, otherwise, it will not save nothing. So for the time being, this boys will still have the eye here. Uh, we could go and make those three mark two. We could put another three of them. We can bring another bell. We could do all that, but it's not good. It's not good because we don't have the power to do that. Look at this. Oops. Yeah, sinks. On their copper line. Um, something just popped up. Amazing. I think it's one of the miners. So, our maximum consumption is 960. Our capacity is 144. So, that, that ain't gonna cut it. Okay, because on this one, it's with the biomass burners, they will move away from it. Production is 120. So, we have what, 240 megawatts? That's nothing. We need to increase that. Not to increase that, we're gonna do whatever we did in here with this eight on the other side. In there, somewhere in there. We have two normals and two impures. Those two impures, I wanna kinda keep them for the transport. But we're gonna use those two normals. That means we can put a, a bunch of these guys. So. In here we also have two normals. That's two, four, six, eight, one normal, and two, four, six, eight, another normal. So let's prepare for that power. Okay, we're gonna need sixteen of this. We're gonna need six of this. Uh, what? Well, actually, we could double it even more because now we have Mark twos. Well, those are upgraded, BAG. How do you want to do this? Yeah, you know what? 
Let's make sure we get the power. You know, 32 of this. Uh, production. Because these guys have shards on them. That's what I meant. We're gonna make a mark too. Uh, that means we can put 32 in the top. So there's just a standing. Me likes it. We're gonna need a bunch of belts mark free, a bunch of pipage. Uh, but apparently, we kind of have everything we need here. Let's fill up our inventory with stuff and uh, see what we can do about this. I need to remove between the episodes. Yeah. So, all of this man, let me get up top. Oh my god, I would have liked to be up top in there, but it ain't happening now. Can I make it up top? Yeah. I love the way this leather is making it's continuing here so uh we have in here our one two three miners and each one of them has smelters okay four five whatever it doesn't matter i'm gonna delete all the bushes and everything in there make a big platform each miner is gonna pump up the ore up top and all the smelting is gonna happen in there and then it's gonna be delivered in the, those lines in there most likely I'll be able to do only one miner overclocked two let's say so I want that space free in there everything that you see here is gonna go away yeah that one too so this box is in here we'll have to continue like that I think I'm gonna leave myself some space in here for passage in the back and in there but we're gonna continue with those from there in there and from here in there impossible because they got a miner well from there in there that miner will lift up deliver the iron ore in there that one the same that one the same that one the same all the smelting is gonna happen in there but I'm gonna do that by my own between episodes, right now, we have other things to do. Let's grab some reinforced iron plates out of here. How many we need? 721 out of 760. Basically, I have 321. We only have 400. So, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, that will be enough to build whatever I have in there. The excess of 400. I don't think they're gonna be enough for the market belts, so I just grab 400 more. Let me get rid of those. Get rid of those, even if they don't upload. Guess what? You can keep them in there. Amazing. More storage for us. I don't need those stators on me. Let's drop them in here. Uh, what else? We're oh, gonna need a bunch of conquest. Uh, let's see. Bro, 426440. Where am I always? In here. Okay, good stuff. So, here we go. We got all the rotors that we need. We need 440. We got 500. 100 in here, 400 in Dimensional Depot. As I'm consuming them, they will be re uploaded by that, which is just a standing. Uh, copper sheets, 240. Copper sheets, we're in here. Uh, we're gonna need a little more. Only 240 in the Dimensional Depot. So let's take 600 more, something like that, my things. I don't need those in case beams. Oh, or do I? I need them. Well, don't need them on me, I said. So you're gonna leave them in here. No point in grabbing them with me. Um, I would like to fill those up because we're gonna need the power, we're gonna need the poles, we're gonna need a bunch, a bunch of those. So let's just fill up, because we gotta make a platform under there. Uh, don't need the pipes, or do we? Do we need the pipes in there? Yeah, I don't know. Let's leave the pipes in here, let's leave the beams in here, sorry. Oh no, it's beams are mark free belt so i can leave some of the reinforced because we're gonna have 240 on each so these guys were not exactly good okay how many i can leave back 
Um, reinforce number is 760. Now we're missing, right? Okay, good stuff. Let's fill that one up. Uh, cables. Yeah, we're gonna need a bunch of you. Cables are waiting here, BAG. I don't know where you're going, but here we are. Let's take 600. We're gonna need a bunch of concrete, mister. A bunch of concrete. Yeah, concrete. So, the other caviar with that, um, whatchamacallit, steel production of ours that we're gonna do here, is that all of those recipes that you saw in there with the special molded beam, molded pipe, they're taking concrete. And it's not like two pieces, no, it's like hundreds of pieces, okay? So we're gonna have to put a mark on that pure node in there and uh, basically upgrade it, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's gonna have to happen. Okay, let's put the power in first, going towards our new power place in there, towards the coal, and uh, start making it happen, you know? I put two in here, at some point in here, I wanna have a train. Uh, or at least a tractor because guess what in there can we go with this one or this one? let's go with the other one in there we have four I think pure iron nodes and a lot of the goodies you know so I think I wanted those being used to make something I don't know we're gonna need a bunch of iron at some point I'm taking heavy module frames or something like that. Something that eats a bunch of steel. It's gonna happen in there. So I could transport them with a tractor or I could transport them by train. I would like to have trains very much, mister, because the coal is good to be used as fuel in the beginning. After what we're gonna get to fuel power, well, things are gonna be a lot different. A lot different. Because you're gonna have power, and we'll be able to use those trains as much as we want. For the time being, we're gonna have to rely on those nodes for power later down the road. Well, things are gonna be different. Wait a second. I think we're gonna rip up the production from still from there, and we're gonna make it happen in there. You know why? Because that limestone pure it's in there i could bring it in here but in here we got that one and there's another one around there ish i don't remember where which i think they're normal let's scan for them and see that means i will have uh one for eight in there it should have been one in there the at least that's how i remember it I uh, don't even want to know what, what are those. Okay, good stuff. So we got normal in here, we got that pure in there. And it was another one in here normal. That will give me all the concrete that I need. Yeah, I think that's the way to do it. Where are those dismantle grids? In there? Oh, when I dismantle that one in here? Is that what happened? I deleted this. And I didn't have the inventory space. Let me grab them. Um, I'll continue with this stuff magic in here. <laughs> Can I make it? Without falling like an idiot? No. Okay, good stuff. Um, yeah, that, that happened. I'll continue with this amazing stuff until the end. And I'll meet you guys where is the... Say his name. Exactly. The coal. Okay, so we made it in here somehow. Uh, let's scan for that coal because I don't remember which is which. So this is normal, that is normal, and those in there are impure. So we will not touch those though. That guy and that guy. We will take care of this guy in there, that guy in here. Good stuff. Can I put down the mark to miner? 
production mark mana I need yeah I need stuff so I'm gonna need four of these get to clear the miners four hours by the way the good thing we have the damage on you is this hope is gonna be enough okay so mark two miner Coming up in here, sending the products. I don't even know where. Um, <clears throat> gonna need the water, so most likely it's gonna happen in there. Yeah, I'm gonna put a big platform in there, call it good. So, I don't know, let's put it like that. How much you're making? 120. Perfect. So, oh uh, no, 120. Divided by 15, that's 8. I'm gonna need to double you. Who's sitting with that bar? Not that good. 240 megawatts. Um, 15. Yeah, I think we can go with this. We can do this. Give me the chance. Where are my shants? Who took my shants? In here. Perfect. So you're gonna have to make the fourth thing. That means mark three. Um death away somehow. Okay. Uh I think you can start producing stuff for us, thank you. And then um sorry, then. let's make the other one in there. And we're gonna have two belts, basically. Okay? Okay. Here we go. Same history here. 240. We have two belts with 240. Now, I don't need this one aligned to the grid. No. That's not how it works here. But we're gonna need a bunch of space for 32 of these guys from 12 water extractors. Oh my god, it's gonna be just sustained. So I wanna leave myself space in here for water extractor. In here I have it. I think. Yeah, I have it. So we're gonna go there. In here. We have in here the space for water extractors. So again, I don't know how big it's gonna be. But that's a totally different story. I think... 32 so it's gonna be 16 on one side 16 on one side and I'm gonna come with those belts 16 going that way 16 going that way so I don't remember how big they are but I think they're kind of big um most likely we're gonna need 20 that way 20 that way I think it's only five deep Let's make it six, just sleep easy at night, you know? And let's make it happen. Now this one is gonna go so fast with my blueprints, it's gonna be just so standing. Apparently the water is getting higher in here for some reason. I don't know how that's gonna sound, but it's fine. Good stuff. Somebody's gonna need the building tower in here. Let's, let's invent I don't know. Let's get in the middle. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Just like that. And then we're gonna need another one in here. Just to know what we're doing in here, you know? <laughs> because otherwise it's gonna look like shit if we don't have the fly image again. One, two, three, four, five. Okay? If we don't have that. Uh, I forget how it's called. You know the one with which you fly? Yeah, that guy. That guy, which is not the other guy. Okay, look at our... Okay. Now, let's get up in here. First. And let's see what we can do. Nice platform, wouldn't you? 
so my code is gonna come from there and from there like that it's gonna come in here perfect we have in here blueprints power we have four cold generators guess what <gasps> it's gonna be so easy so easy look at this align them okay um why is it like that oh they made different so this one will work one that's in there but with those splitters oriented like that it's not gonna work one that's in here i should have made four with different entries you know so we're gonna have four going that way let's try and put it to the middle of the foundation if we can h get down break your legs but just a tiny bit you know not too much you can pass through this because it's not solid yet so i want this one on that line i sit on that line well on that line it looks pretty good we have four building in blueprint mode can further optimize your construction process with snapping and quick dismantling options Build modes are not just there to make your work easier, they compensate for inevitable human error. Fixit understands humanity like no other, and humanity needs you to be efficient and productive at all times. Have you understood what the lady said? You gotta be like that, mister. No other way. That's why we're using blueprints in here. <laughs> just because she said it. Not that we are lazy and we don't want to put down 32 code generators with all the respective magnets in here no, no, no. now issues when i'm gonna put it like that it's gonna be painful with the water i just realized that so i think i don't want to go in there anymore. yeah i mean this side is cool delete that we're gonna have to adapt no other chance uh so let's get up here and we will adapt, don't you worry about it. Um, blueprints? We're gonna need 16 in here. So they're being fed from there. Okay, we know that. Okay, let me leave myself half a foundation so that I can walk. Uh, I don't know, something like that. Because I need to place the water magic is in here. So, four, eight, uh -huh. Enough. Uh, sorry? F, no brain. Copy that. H. It's not It's like We have eight. We're gonna need another eight. Amazing, isn't it? I know. Okay, let's take care of that belt. It's a mark. Don't worry. We're gonna make it a mark three. Let's connect that pipe. Let's connect that power pole in there. Okay, let's get down without breaking our legs if we can. Yep. It worked this time. I don't know how, but it worked. Did it this because no longer needed. Sorry, normal. You too. Perfect. But let's continue with this one in here. Uh, this one will have to be built. These guys can go away, all of them. Those will have to continue that way. No other choice. It is what it is. Is this my main? Yeah, this is my main. So, from here, everything goes away. Cool! We got eight down. Let me put the other eight. I will talk about it just a tiny bit, you know? <laughs> now, you do realize that these boys, they're gonna take a lot of power, right? I mean, this circuit in here. Uh, yeah, we have no connection, but they're gonna take a lot of power. So. But they make them work in batches, you know. Let's take care of this then, because all of it is gonna have to be Mark free. Okay. okay, and let's go straight with it. Uh, let's leave it on the side, so that I can have some space to walk around here. Now, you know me. You know how I plan 
and how I work with these guys. That thing needs to be filled up with coal be before we start anything. Let's bring it more like a line with that. Now at least they're gonna get filled up with the coal. It's time to put the water. Now for eight of them, we need free water. Oh jeez. For sixteen, we need six. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. I think I wanna get a tap on these boys just to be able to see better what I'm doing here. So let's connect them, I don't know, skipping two or something like that, you know. So I yeah, have six in here. Uh, that one I don't think it's needed anymore. You can delete it. Perfect. Let me connect the pipes and I'll be right back with you. Okay, so the pipes are connected. Um, of course, we don't have power in here. <laughs> so let me bring the power in here just so that we can have this guy starting to pump water inside of everything basically could you please let me in here thank you okay they started working which is very good uh we're gonna have water inside of them they're gonna have to be filled up with coal and with water when this belt is gonna be stuck that means all of them 16 are filled up now we're gonna have a little issue here I didn't realize that, uh, but when I made that blueprint, I made it going from the left to right. As I was looking for the blueprint machine, it doesn't really matter, okay? It doesn't really matter because I can twist those. Okay, if I put them like this, my entry is to my left point here, but we can still make it work. I can start from there and go up top of them, or I'm gonna turn them the other way, okay? Because I don't know where the wall limit is in there. I don't want to get in there too much. So we're going to do exactly this. Like that. And we're going to cut it on the other end, basically. That means some of first four. going to have the next four, the next four, the next four, the next four, so on and so forth. I don't know if they're told. 16 or not. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, it's good. It's good. I did a good job in there. Well, let me put the other ones. I'll bring you guys back. Okay, so both of these belts stopped. That means all of these boats filled up. We got 16 on one side, 16 on one side. Um, hmm? uh, 25? No, 75 each. 1475 was it? Yeah. It's gonna be just amazing, you know? Let me just start them up because this is the most pleasant thing ever. And um, <laughs> we're gonna look at this sparkle when it's all said and done. Now, all of them are connected. Gotta, <laughs> gotta love those uh, stacks, you know? I mean, 16 of them on one side, 16 of them on the other side. It's a bunch of power in there, mister. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. I'm telling you. Now, we can play with a bunch of stuff in there. We have a production of 3,600 megawatts. Out of the coal alone, which is just outstanding. I'm pretty glad we did this. Uh, brought this, how should I call it, platform in here. Uh, this will give us access to a bunch of stuff. Man, I love that. Look at that. Look at that. How beautiful it is. Mm -hmm. What do you think about that? Let's take a photo. I guess you know now where I got my thumbnail. <laughs> uh, I'll be back at some point just to make uh, hide that. all of that in concrete because I love it more like that. This one is gonna give us access to the resources that are in here as well because as I told you, we got a bunch of good stuff, okay? We get somewhere around there-ish, I don't know where in the back, some pure limestone out, 
we got in here four of those amazing amazing pure iron nodes i think they're in here those or in there i don't remember exactly where they are but they are somewhere in there and it's gonna be just sustaining you know because we're gonna build in here stuff and with those two impure coal nodes that we have in there we'll be able to grab some coal and deliver it on this road let's call it up until our base with a tractor with a truck with something like that later than the road i want to modify all this and add in here to our free lines just to have trains moving and grooving um the platform where it's all gonna happen is gonna be somewhere in there in there in the back um we have in here up here somewhere Caterium. we have uranium i think we also have bauxite but i'm not pretty sure about that i could be mistaken nevertheless we did get the day now when we're gonna get the fuel power these boys down here will have to go away and we're gonna take that coal and turn it into something else um i don't know what okay we don't have enough sulfur here i think it's a normal sulfur node around there i was thinking making combat coal like one or two of those and leave the other two for the steel production and uh, make it compact coal just to put it in front of there take advantage of those oil nodes that we got in there we got a bunch of pures like four or something like that and make it happen with the turbo fuel genies i mean why not you know nevertheless still a ways to go in there until we're gonna get that point let's put how many of this stuff we have? We have 750. Let's grab those. Yeah, makes no point in grabbing them. No. In the next episode, we will go take care of that still in there. It's fog. Cannot see a thing. So, I wanna put Mark 2 miners on them. Both on the coal and on the iron. And double their production there. And if we can bring that limestone from there that one from there two normals and this period here always in there and having there well i don't know if i should do that yet. having there the production for the steel beams and for the steel pipes but i would like that production to be on our platform in here now i think we're gonna keep the production in here and we'll overclock that one just to give us if we can have it all the steel that we need let's put back those two foundries because i think i deleted them yeah I did. okay let's put them back and see exactly how much content are we gonna need so we said we're gonna have 360 of that stuff okay one is all the beam one is all the pipe okay this is 120 this one is gonna be 240 that's what we said because this one is giving me 45 it's gonna be 90 with the summer sloops and this one is gonna be uh, four times so 200 something like 400 pipes i believe we don't need that many so we might leave it normal we just make 240 in here and one I cannot make calculation. So 360 minus the 4120. 120. So it's giving me 120 pipes and 90 beams. Yeah, I think that's a good number. I think that's a good number. We're gonna keep it like this. So we're gonna have two of this and the reminder of this 120. So three of this. That means I'm gonna need in here like 100? No. 30, 60, let's say 90 and in here another uh, 100 so we're gonna need 270 concrete if we multiply that one with 3 because that's the rate of the concrete we're gonna need oh oh 
That's not good. We're gonna need 810 limestone. That one is able to provide that, but not with the Mark II miner. Even if he's able to provide that, we don't have belts for 800 and something limestone. So that's not good. That's not good at all. Let's see. With the production that we have right now, so it's gonna be 120 and another, let's see, 16 here. That'll give me 60 pipes and 45 beams. At this point, we have 30 beams, I believe. Yes, these 30 beams and pipes, we get 40 pipes. So 40 and 30. 40 and 30. 40. So this one we're gonna have 45 instead of 3 0, 15 more. And this one is gonna be 60. Yeah, 50% product, production increase. And if we're gonna put the summer slips in here, which we can totally do because now we have power, it's gonna give us even more. But that will mean that we will need 36 concrete and another 80. 36 plus 80, that's 116 multiplied by 3, 276. Mark 3 and a little more. I think we can do that. Mark 4 belt. It, this is what we're gonna need here. But 270 is gonna be just enough if we let it fill up. If I put a buffer here, if I put something. So we're gonna take from that limestone. Our 270 whatever uh, limestone and call it good, you know. That's what we're gonna do. And turn all this node in here into concrete. It's gonna happen right in here. It's gonna be a platform. We're gonna make it happen and call it good, you know. I'm gonna get rid of that tree right about now. Just like that. Just not to have it in the way. It's done. It has been dealt with. We have a platform in here. Uh, it's gonna be just sustaining. So, for the next one, we're gonna take all of this node, make it into concrete, wipe that concrete somewhere in here, jump this amazing line, because what else can you do? And um, put it into, I don't know, two, three, four, four foundries. Make molded beams and molded pipes. And that will triple our production. Because at this point, we're making 100 only by using, let's see, that recipe, this recipe. We're going to make 150. And with the summer slope. We're gonna make 300. That's just amazing. That is just amazing. I'll be able to move this production from here into her final spot next to that guy. That guy in there is making the smart plating. This guy here is gonna be in there. I'm gonna grab those modular frame from there, sneaking through there. 2.5 per minute. We're gonna have our 30 beams from here. It's cool because we're gonna have 90. So we're still gonna have a reminder of 60, which is just amazing. And we're gonna make it happen, you know. But that, of course, is gonna be only in the next episode. This one is kinda long as it is. We wasted a lot of time talking about what I did in here between episodes. I hope you guys enjoy it. And we also made it happen for 2,400 megawatts. That is just amazing it is just amazing i'm gonna leave those in there just for good measure so all of this will go away um i think i want to work with buffers in here that means this will go away in here this one will have a buffer in here a big one you know like this or maybe in there and the concrete from here is going to be delivered in another buffer i'm gonna make that one by myself after what i did all this production line here and 
into the next one we will start taking care of the foundries between the episodes i will make it happen for those constructors as well because it's not that hard 270 divided by 45 i only need six constructors in there six uh not mark five mark three you see put it in the face of my uh, my miner in here which is gonna be a mark so of course we're gonna upgrade it to seven and that's it we just made our concrete happen done still have some place to pass through here apparently just gonna have to break that put the miner deliver it in here put the recipe in everything is nice and then you know gotta love it gotta love it i'm loving it building with blueprints oh my god it's just insane it is i ain't kidding you guys we're gonna leave this one here thank you so much for being here i'm gonna do those and see you in the next one if by any chance you enjoy this don't forget to drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't you're gonna see more and if by any chance you want to support my dream of becoming a full-time content you can do that by grabbing yourselves an amazing membership. Thank you again. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of you all.